In Allentown is out of a home and it's been that way for months for them now. At the heart of the problem, a major sinkhole and a water main break. But when it comes to getting answers or some financial help, both the insurance company and the Lehigh County leaders there have been slow to step in. Action News' Walter Perez live for us with more uh, from the family who has no idea, Walter, when they'll get back in their home. That's right, Sherry. We'll give you a live look right here at that sinkhole that we're talking about right next to this home that has since been deemed uninhabitable. Now, the upshot is that the family that owns this house has been living with extended family since the hole developed two days after this past Christmas, and the end of this saga is nowhere in sight. This was the scene along Devonshire Road in Allentown just about six months ago after a nearby water main burst. Neighbors say the water flowed like a river for days. Laura Zimmerman's home, which she shared with her 86-year-old mother, was among the hardest hit. This sinkhole developed, compromising the home's structural integrity, and the situation is not getting any better. The house could still sink. It could still fall in if further soil erosion around the house continues. And as of tonight, Laura says she still has no idea when or if she and her mom will be allowed to go back home. Laura says her homeowner's insurance policy does include coverage for sinkholes, but she quickly learned that apparently not all sinkholes are alike. Our sinkhole apparently doesn't meet their requirements or their standards. I'm looking for help. And I have sinkhole insurance and I have sinkholes. And so as the Lehigh County Authority and the insurance companies squabble about whether the water main break caused the sinkhole or vice versa, time is running out for Laura and her mom because their homeowner's insurance policy expires in about two months. Laura admits she is preparing for the worst. The house is pretty much packed up. We've got some stuff in storage. We're still going through things because I don't know if I'm ever going to be able to come back to my home. All right, back out live here. Now, Laura and her mom are both retired, living on a fixed income. And so, as you'd imagine, losing this home with nothing to show for it would result in a serious financial hardship. Meanwhile, we did reach out to Laura's insurance carrier to better understand why this sinkhole doesn't match up with her policy. So far, we have not heard back. Reporting live from Allentown, Walter Perez, Channel 6 Action News. Rick.